everybody, Joe Joseph here for TheDailySheeple.com, and this is your new shot. Let's go to the Daily Star over in the UK. They say, inside the chilling religion creating God robot, a billion times smarter than humans, say a former Uber worker has formed an odd cult to build a Godhead robot. That's right. That's supposed to be, like, super smart. Like the collective brain power of every human on Earth. Anthony Lewandowski says he's created a way, the way, he says, of the future. A religion based around a super-powered AI. Now, the tech boffin is looking for followers of the new religion to help him build super-intelligence into a bot, which then they'll worship. And when asked about how powerful his God would be, Lewandowski was not shy in talking up his, its intelligence. He said, what's going to be creative? or created, will effectively be a god. He said it's not a god in the sense that it makes lightning or causes hurricanes, but if there's something a billion times smarter than the smartest human, what else are you going to call it? Very interesting uh, way of looking at it, I have to say. Now, outlining the beliefs of his new church, the way of the future outlaws supernatural powers, claiming everything can be solved through science. They also believe that machines, just like animals, have rights and that rights to become and the rights to become super intelligence and in a chilling glimpse into the future Lewandowski adds that computers would definitely end up being smarter than humans so he also added that if you ask people whether a computer can be smarter than people than humans a lot of people already acknowledge that that's the case and he's not revealed his plans for the robot but it's going to be a super AI and I guess he's he's looking for funding to do this I just find it interesting that here we have another way of acknowledging where we're at really in the world today with regards to technology that can have a very detrimental and a very beneficial impact on humanity. Again, it's all in the way it is executed. It's all in the way that it's brought about. The problem that I have is that we have a historical track record to go back and look at with regards to implementing technology that alters the course of humanity as we know it. And almost every time and in almost every case, matter of fact, I can't find a case where we've actually done it right. We screwed it up. And it's been used against us. Oh, there'll be crumbs that are sprinkled that just show the potential benefits of this, but there'll only be crumbs. And then, meanwhile, the majority of, the majority of it, that technology will be deployed to be used against us. And eventually, if people like Ray Kurzweil over at Google get their way, why then humanity will be just done away with? Because it's obsolete. The biological components, he says, won't be missed. And for a lot of people, maybe that's the case. The problem is, science itself is a dogma. Science itself is just like the way of the future, this church. It's one giant cult. A religion, if you will. No different. Very few things in science are proven. Scientists often grasp at straws and take incredible risk to learn crumbs, basically. And that's how we've advanced. Only now, that acceleration curve has just dramatically increased. And I don't really think, and I don't know, maybe all of you out there can comment below, but I don't think that humanity is ready for what's coming. And I would say the chances are better than not, better that they will be catastrophic to humanity than they won't be. So I'll be interested to see your comments below, but interesting now that humans are beginning to worship computers. Mm. Very, very interesting indeed. I'm Joe Joseph. This was the DailySheeple.com's new shot.
feel free to comment below and visit our website at thedailysheeple.com. Hashtag wake the flock up. Have a great day, everybody.